Hey there guys, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5 Blind, you know, Damiel SC. Last time, we, um, looked for Kanashiro, we already know where it is, actually. We we found Kanashiro's palace, he apparently self-identifies as an alien. Um, his, his palace is a flying source, saucer. Sorcerer? I think I started to say sorcerer. So, go to bed. Well then. You won't let me do anything tonight. I wonder if I have to make something over at the bench. I've been thinking lately. You've been thinking for a long time. Give yourself some credit, Makoto. About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Oh, that's... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. I was like, that's always so terrible whenever someone's like, Well, I think Dad would want us to do this. It's like, well, how do you argue with that? There's The person that you're trying to emulate is not around to agree or disagree. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if he would have been on their side. That's all. I wonder what happened to their mom, because isn't Sai her older sister? The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. I notice you're not answering the question, Sai. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. That is incredibly a not answer to the question. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Okay, well, you have time right now. What are you doing? You're eating. Is that taking up the entirety of your mental capacity? Seriously, that, that is a classic deflection right there. Oh, you're thinking this thing because I do a lot for you. Okay, and? <laughs> That's not an answer. That's just a deflection. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. Well, what do you fucking do for you, Sai? He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Wow, okay, I officially don't like Sai anymore. I, you know, it's, it's, it, up until now, I thought she just had a different point of view on society, and, you know, it's not wrong. She's just a very, very rigid justice type that is like, you know, anyone that commits crimes, no matter what the reason, needs to be punished for them. You know, you don't, you can't, she, she was not willing to accept the idea that sometimes, you know, a society gets to the point where you, the only way to resist is to break the law, because the law's gotten too controlled. At this point, though, she's just straight up shitting on a dead guy. <laughs> Seriously, shitting on a dead guy. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? No, it's not, especially because you're bitch at... Okay, I'm, not, I'm, I'm overreacting, I'm sorry. Especially because Sai keeps saying, just focus on your studies, don't worry about the real world. And now, she suddenly, shouldn't you grow up and acknowledge the real... No, you're the one that's freaking been telling her not to! Oh, I, I always have a difficult time with parental figures. And in this case, I do absolutely believe Sai is the personal figure in this relationship. Being inconsistent with their expectations of the people that are, tr are really just trying to, you know, impress them and, you know, work with them. Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. Okay, well then, I'm sorry that you're not r ready for the responsibility that you have. Why is that her fault? I will admit, I got a r bum deal in this one because she's not the mother, as far as I know. She's the older sister. I don't know where the mother is. I don't know why the mother is not taking care of the situation. I'm not sure why Sai has to take care of a younger sister that she had nothing to do with. You know, and that does suck for her. But at the same time... She's the older one in this relationship, and she damn well has responsibility not to take out her frustrations on someone who is just as innocent in this, you know... Sai's situation is shitty, but so is Makoto's. It's not like Makoto's at fault here. Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just really tired. Really tired doesn't cut it after something like that. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. It's a good thing that there's a phantom thief because Makoto might well kill herself after that. Good lord. You know, being told by your the one person left that you kind of aspire to be that you're a mistake and a burden on her life. We ain't got nothing. We need to get something. Get a grappling hook. Are we out of luck? Get a rocket pack. Get something that looks like a rocket pack, because then, then society will see that as a possible rocket pack. Dress up like Rocket Man. 
It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro. What? Why would we want to do that? Hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Hmm. Huh. That's so. Yep, she's obviously spying on us. But I mean, we, she has a lot of eggs invested in the Persona basket, so... You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? Can you blame her? Why wouldn't she be? You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. Man, poor Makoto. She just told she was useless, like, last night. Useless? Right now, you're useless to me. Exactly, that's what I... Oh my god. Eat away at my life, life, life. It's interesting, like, I like all the characters of this game, but I feel like they've really sold me on Makoto before she even joined the team. Before I even get to get to rank one in her social link, I'm just completely, you know, I really, really, really empathize with Makoto. To be frank, yes. You just can't even know her. Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop, since you're so good at it? I, I, Anna's the one that cracks me up the most, because Anna's the one that had a whole bunch of completely baseless rumors circulating around her, and she's the one that has gripped into the baseless rumors circulating around Makoto the most. So you wish to get in contact with Kanashiro? That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? I, it's a little bit of an awkward situation for her, because she is very, very much in a position where um, she wants us to succeed, but to a certain extent, she also kind of wants to see us fail. It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. Nothing <laughs> you. Oh my God! How 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 immature and windy would that have to be? <laughs> Answer her honestly. What possible good does it do us to lie? Do you want to get, you know, reported? So you're just the good girl type to push over. Right now, you're useless to me. I'm not. What was that? She's having almost a mental breakdown, which is actually, I just said that if the fan of these weren't a thing in this game, if she didn't have us to eventually be an outlet, I think she might actually become suicidal, because just like everyone in the world that she thinks matters is just shitting on her. Fine. I'll help you meet Kanashiro. What exactly is she planning on doing? She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kanashiro may be? Yeah, we should totally follow her. I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Yeah, that's the face of someone who gets stuff done. Uh, what is up with her? I still think my jetpack idea is better. Here. We're never going to find her. Hello? It's me, Makoto Nijima. Yeah, I know. We're chasing you. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kanashiro? What? That idiot! What's she doing? God damn, we're, we're going to have to run in there and get her into the shadow world in order to keep her from getting killed. I could find someone named Kanashiro if I came to Central Street. Central Street! She's being too rash. She's being way too rash. We, she got pushed into a corner. What are you getting at? He's blackmailing the students at Shujin Academy, is he not? Tell him if he doesn't want me talking to the police about it, he better agree to meet with me. Got a death wish or something? He's a pierced man. He says he'll meet you. Get in. You better be taking me to Kanashiro. He said, "Get the fuck in." <laughs> Wasn't 
net. Yeah, that was. That's she's gonna. I wonder if it's gonna turn into a rescue operation. It's the guys that messed with us the other day. So they were connected to Kanashiro. We kind of thought they were. Is she still on? Contact Kanashiro, son. Tell him we got a good one. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kanashiro san's customer. <laughs> you normally do stuff to people? Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them. Obviously. I'm surprised they used a car. Ryuji, get a taxi. Okay, I've got their license plate. My sketching skills will come in handy. You didn't need sketching skills to write down a license plate. One way, man, Ryuji actually was really concerned about Makoto. That's that. I didn't expect him to be the one that was on point for trying to save her. So you're seriously the student council president of Shujin? Wow, this guy is. Wow. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So whose number is this? Your boyfriend? What in the world? Are we seeing this or hearing this? Who the fuck are you? Nijima-san. What the hell did you do to her? Oh, I get it. You got followed, you dumb shits. <laughs> Holy moly! Can we grab that and Nijima? That bag you saw the other day. The crocodile one? How much was it? Mm, about three million. Ah! <gasps> For real? Better thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? No, I don't. I've never had enough money to be able to use that as an outlet. It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. Oh, we will. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. It pisses me off even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. Wait, you want us to give you three million? What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? You, you abducted the student council president. I mean, I feel like my response would be pull out a phone and just take a picture of the fact that they're holding a girl down and you know, sitting all around her. I'd be like, okay, can I send this to the police? Let's go. I realized that would not go all that well for me, but it damn well wouldn't go well for him. Uh, that's... Oh, damn, I got booze and cigs in the shot. Maybe some drugs, too. Ah, oh, this is so hilarious. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. You damn well didn't get her in the shot, or you got, you know, your thug standing, like, pinning her to the ground. That's definitely not going to be anything against her. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police, and I'll break all of you, starting with your families. I want to give you the usual one, but well, you have such a large group here. Three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. I still, I, I'm not sure I buy that Again, I don't live in Japan, but an average person having, you know, oh look, I took a picture of some people in a club standing um, away from a booth with drugs in it. I mean, it's like, the shot would be, it was like, look, I, whoever took the shot has the drugs, the table's in front of them. I'm on the other side of the shot. The worst thing get me is that I walked into a club, and I, I don't feel like Japan would actually care. I mean... <laughs> 
obviously, again, I've got a record, but Kadashiro can't, doesn't know that. So, it, the, the, the threat doesn't, I don't even understand how the threat would make any sense. The other ones where they, like, did, you know, like, drug smuggling, that's a fucking threat. <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. Yeah, I was gonna say, grab Makoto and go into the Shadow World. Okay, and so I've got three weeks, because I, I was down to like nine days or something, and I was a little bit crazy. So what did meeting him actually do? How did that help me at all? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. Well, you sure meant to drag us in before. <laughs> For real. I was stupid. Kinda, yeah. I must agree. You should have easily imagined this happening. I love how just, like, deadpan and straightforward Yusuke is. Hey, Yusuke! I was so caught up in trying to be useful. Alright, enough of the blame game. What's done is done. <laughs> kitty, kitty. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. That is true. You're definitely gonna cause trouble for Sis. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job and... She's a much more remarkable person than me. A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. I do. I still want to know what happened to her mom. I'm sure I will find out at some point, but it just seems a massive gap in what she's saying. But I'm still a child, so all I am is a burden to her. Hmm. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. I just noticed that the school insignia on her collar says BJ. Does that mean... I wonder if that means she's going to end up being the Priestess Arcana, because I remember very well from my Brazil 3 Let's Play that BJ is on the Priestess Arcana um, boss that I was very, very, very sketchy about, because I did not actually realize that was a thing when I saw the boss the first time. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but... Ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. I Japanese games have people with one eye closed more than any other genre I've ever seen. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. Oh, that thing that I thought you meant what just happened. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. <sighs> People like me must really be what others call scum of the earth. Poor Makoto. It's, it's, it, whenever you hate someone and then they admit to all the stuff, you know, you realize that they aren't what they thought you were, but they took everything you said to heart, you almost feel like an asshole. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that, and I do too. Then maybe you shouldn't have blamed Makoto earlier. Kamaki-san. Interesting, son. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now get in the Shadow World. I want to see your outfit. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. So can we please just drop the case with Kanashiro? Oh, hell no. No can do. We're all caught up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuji. <laughs> bank? <laughs> Ryuji is so bad at this undercover stuff. Oh, right. The bank. She isn't useless at all. She may be our key in. How? How does that kitty? 
<laughs> Not right now. Oh, kitty, calm down. Hear me out, you guys. Poor Makoto is just this cat's meowing at everyone. Our key in? What do you mean? A cat? Um, are you all okay? We've become Kaneshiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kaneshiro's bank. Okay, that's true. I hadn't considered that. I see. The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. And wouldn't you say that she in particular is a special customer? Uh, why? Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Whoa, I don't follow this at all. She risked her life doing something so reckless. At the very least, she has the right to know. Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? Yeah, where are we going? Kamoshida's bank. I guess it's Kamoshida. Beats me. Welcome to Phantom Thievery. So this probably won't really be... A canine? It's Fox. <laughs> well, foxes are canines. Be quiet. The shadows are going to notice us. A monster cat? <laughs> okay, kitty, stop attacking my face while I'm recording. I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice... Takamaki-san? Where are we? This is the land of the Shadow Labyrinth. We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well, the world inside his heart. What? I love how I just lay it out. I'm, I feel like whenever we did this with um, Yusuke, he just sort of was like, oh, okay. That's interesting. And she, uh, she of course, going to be a more normal person and be like, what the hell are you talking about? It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Another reality? It's floating in the air. Th this is reality? My goodness. <sighs> I I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists... I can't doubt it. N yeah, you can't. A reality that one's heart shows. I is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? <laughs> uh, no idea. That's something we have no idea about. I see. So stealing one's heart, that may be like overriding their cognition. I think I kind of get the logic behind it. Ain't she more amazing than you? <laughs> We're about the same. No, I think I think she actually has a, a psychological background, so she actually understands this way better than Morgana does. Then, does that mean there's an ATM version of myself somewhere in this world too? Perhaps. Regardless, we can change Kaneshiro's heart and make him confess if we steal his treasure. If it all goes well, that is. Oh, it'll go well. We'll make it go well. Awesome, that's exactly what I wanted to say, Ryuji. You're the man. Everyone will notice us for sure if we take someone like Kaneshiro down. Our justice will also become resolute. Think we'd be able to give courage to those in need if it happens? For the sake of those in need, huh? You sound like my father. Your father sounds like a stand-up guy. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. If I've become a customer of that bank, then they'll have to let me in. Not to mention that um, I feel like this is not really the expiration one. I think this is going to be the one that will lead to her awakening to her persona. For real? It came to us. It's just as I calculated. Just as calculated. You 
You know how you can use your card to get into banks during after hours? Um, no, none of us have bank accounts. I thought that I'd be able to get in, since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue after all. Ah, mm. oh, that makes sense. Yeah, they've explained this wow. a couple of times already. Kitty. This place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. Being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious. We're totally robbers. <laughs> you got that right. It seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on. Well, I'm not surprised. Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Uh, not yet you can't. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. But still let us handle it, until you wake. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer, so I better act like one. For now, we'll, we'll, we'll cure you that real quick, though. I will be useful for you guys. Well then, let's head inside. So the question is, who are we trying to leave? I guess we can leave Anne. It's somewhere. K Kitty, please. Okay. It's, it's it's tough. I like I like all the characters. I actually want to kind of rotate through them. But I switched out Anne just to do mementos, and we didn't really get anything. So, I'll I'll probably drop Anne, and then whenever Makoto joins, I'll drop Fox because I didn't use Ryuji last time, and I want to. Um, I definitely feel like we need a healer, so Morgana can't really leave. Business do you have here? We're making I a withdrawal. Feeling this would happen. Come at us. I thought. No, no, wait. She's one of Kanashiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Wow, she is very. Shiro. Do you mean a bank has a president? Well, of course. Yeah, you really know nothing about banks, do you? They make good money. Please wait. Perception is further to the right. So I advise that you do not attempt to go elsewhere. If I'm being watched by security, I'm going to go ahead and do what they say. I'll go elsewhere later. Incredible. Well. Why is the reception room so far away from the entrance? Could I eat with this? Enough to die of like overeating. Unauthorized entry, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? Miss Beautiful President? Wow. It must be quite a tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off then? No, a loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 
So you want to give us a loan so we can pay you, so that we can then repay you more? Ten percent interest a day. Um, uh, that means uh, one day. Thirty thousand. It's three hundred thousand yen. Oh, whoops. <laughs> There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. Oh God damn it! Is he gonna be scummy as well? That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. What is his obsession with calling people beautiful? How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. Well then you know who the rest of us are? My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are so useful. They lack physical strength and are dumb. <laughs> it's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. Yeah, that's. I'm already hating him. Not more than Kamashita, but more than I hated Kamashita at this point, knowing learning about him. You better be ready, Kaneshiro. We're gonna snatch your treasure from you. But usually, if you said that's the real one, you would ruin everything. Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Yeah, but we're the highest thieves. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Okay. Wow, there was a middle one the second ago. It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. I want to say these guys are to Garu. Persona. There. Okay, then it's electricity. Persona. No. I am thou. Do they just not have a weakness? I know they're strong against physical. Let's go. Hachi. Nope. I don't see a weakness. Yeah, definitely resist your physical. I don't see a weakness. Yourself. Let's go. This is my other self. Die. Well, that sucks. I don't. I don't have anything I can really exploit with them. You. Not bad if I say so myself. Persona. Okay, well, I mean, you've got to have a weakness to something. Okay, you go ahead and heal. Thank you. Sorry. Let's go. And you go ahead and boop with them. I gotta focus on healing now. You don't got me. Hmm. Thank you. Thanks. Persona. Yeah. My Persona. Ha! Go ahead and heal us again. Sorry. How am I taking the 
Oh dang, I was hoping that would kill him. Joker! Are you okay? Joker, you're hurt! Don't All get right. restless now! Sorry! I appreciate it. Thanks! Go ahead and hit him, that way the Mabuku will hit. Um, we'll kill off the one. Thank you. Bro. This is my other self. Too slow. Persona. And just back up to full health before we end the fight. Much thanks. Sorry. Crack a boot. Is this? Okay, no, it's not. So like, well, let's just keep going endlessly. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run. Okay, I was going to say, how long does this keep going? Do I? Do you just have to lose? But obviously, that's not what's happening. It can't be. It's like. Why is this creature going to turn into monsters? What are those supernatural powers? Could those have been the personas you mentioned? <laughs> Does that really look like time to be asking that? We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't, don't get separated from us. Joker. You guys want to say something's going to happen on the way out, for sure. Faux show. Sure. You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Well, that's kind of what he does. Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough. That's why I make it a case to kill troublesome customers. Well, you're about to wake, awaken a terrible customer of your own. Having one impertinent breath disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please stop! I'll eliminate others besides my goods. You've no need to worry. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. He is! He, God dang, the second one is just sort of like pocket race, rapist. Not racist. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful if only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. Oh, taking customers mean what I think it means? All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. God damn. I mean, yeah, it's just a straight up forced prostitution at this point. <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. I have been waiting for this. Shut your damn mouth, you money-grubbing asshole! <gasps> I love the awakening you scene so damn much. Track the path of strength? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. She just stomps or she broke this the ceramic. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell?! They make the blow a lot less obvious on the girls. Bleeding. 
Blade Runner. A persona? No, dude. That's a bike. <laughs> Ryuji. I feel it. Myself. Me. Got it. Wow. Nice. What is that? That's a bike. I've never seen anything like it. You better earn your keep, or else I'll kill you! I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop. Right, Johanna? Who's Johanna? I know that's the one chick from Here's the Storm, but I don't think that's who that's referring to. Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! God damn, I love Makoto. I think she may be my card the rest Johanna! of the game. The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. Did she just stay on her bike the whole damn time? Okay, no, she doesn't. That's unfortunate. Charge, Johanna! The enemy's dead. Persona! No! Still don't seem to have anything that can fight. Oh, that guy does not mind fire. God damn! Are these guys weak to anything? Yeah, I've checked everything. He has no weaknesses. He is the master and commander of no weaknesses. Here we go. God, I love her. I cut in. I kind of wanted to see her final cut, but we didn't quite kill him, but I'm sure I will see it. We know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. Yep, let's get out here. But how are we getting out? On the bike? There's only one exit, right? What's up, Miss Post-Apocalyptic Raider? <laughs> Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. I hope I get to control that at some point. Okay, we have a path. Go! Get in! So you'll stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. We'll have to, because we're coming. There's no escape in reality. Nor will you break through the security system here. There's not a snowball's chance in hell that a bright future lies ahead for you. Alright. This has been such a rewarding episode for me, you guys. Mmm. was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I forgot what Aikido was for a second. I'm like, oh yeah, the self-defense thing. I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. <laughs> oh, stop it. I was like, can you not talk about her like she's not here? This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. But it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the Phantom Thieves I was after. I kind of thought you would, but that's granted because the like intro screen spoiled me. Sis might faint if she found out. 
You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? A little bit. No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. That's the thing, as long as they can't actually prove how we did it, they can't arrest us. Except for the fact they've already arrested us, we know, in the future. They've already arrested us and in the again? future. That makes sense. Must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her, too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. Well, that's good, probably. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. Yep, she can be fearless. I'd be honored if I can help out. Oh, you can. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. Dude, it's been like a few hours. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. No, we're gonna go we're going in there, full throttle. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great. We'll pull it off, but I bet I bet it's gonna be another one where we have to go out into the real world and change things. We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Okay, She-Hulk. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. Absolutely. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. Oh, stop talking down to us. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. Halla flippin' Luya. Damn. Oh, we already included in the conversation. Motorcycles are so cool. Wish my persona was like that. Yours is on a yours is on a ship though. Are you kidding? Motorcycles are way cooler than dumb boats. Maybe just like the song. I'm a phantom on a steel horse I ride. Don't say such a and for the record, I am most certainly not wanted. Honestly, I'm mostly surprised you know how to ride a motorcycle at all in Egypt somehow. You do you got a license? Well, a regular one, yes. Not nah, can't we uh, can't wait to get my hands on one of those too. Without a sign, mind if I change the topic for a moment? Well, what's the matter? I'm sorry, everyone. Not in any position to be saying that, but I must apologize. My actions have dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions. I gotta realize what was happening to Suzumi-san too. Oh, come! We don't need to talk about that now. Seems there's still lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now's not the time to be talking about that shit, though. Don't we gotta do something about Kanashiro? Yeah, he's right. Very well, I understand. Anyway, I will do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, we were on with each other just a while ago. But Reed's totally right, we need to work together to overcome this. Okay, it's finally save time. So, we're at like 50 minutes now, I definitely do need to save. So, I will see you all in the next episode where we go into the palace. And we work and distribute our dead justice to all. With justice for all. See you then guys. This.